The Wildcats walked things off in the rubber match of the series against the Air Force Falcons, taking Game 3 by a final score of 3-2 to two in 11 innings and taking the series two games to one. Ari Ross alongside Axel Boada, and it was the Air Force Falcons that got things started early. It was a triple by Adam Grosbeck in the top of the third inning, and he would come around to score on Bradley Haslam's RBI double, giving Air Force an early 1-0 lead. And then in the bottom of the third inning, Charlie Maxwell grounds out into a 4-6-3 double play. Cats had difficulty advancing runners early in this ball game. Top of the fourth, Matt Gaddon gets a big strikeout with the bases loaded, gets out of a huge jam. And the Cats would tie things up on a suicide squeeze. Jack Dunn laid down the bunt. Jake Schieber would come around to score. Northwestern would tie things at one. Air Force would take a 2-1 lead. But the Cats would tie things again. It's an errant throw by the shortstop. And coming around to score from second was Jack Dunn tying the game at two. And we'd head to extras. Josh Levy plays stellar ball in six innings of relief. Here he strikes out Russell Williams. He'd give up just one run. Four hits, three strikeouts, he earns the win. And in the bottom of the 11th, one swing was all Connor Lynn needed to end it. He sends a ball way, way back and gone. Ending this one in the bottom of the 11th, a solo shot off the end of Connor Lynn's bat. He'd been struggling early on in the series, but he's pumped up here because he sends the Cats home with just their second series win of the year by a final score of 3-2. to two. Northwestern wins it in 11 innings.